Hello and welcome back to our NCAA Football 2005 Marine Corps Patriots Dynasty. We are in Season 4 already. You missed the bowl game and offseason from Season 3. Stop what you're doing right now and go back and rewatch that one. That is the last episode. Uh, we're going to be playing a bunch of games here today. We are in the ACC now. And let's take a quick look at the team schedule. What we got? Alright, so we're going to be seeing at least these first four games. So, we got Air Force, then at Notre Dame, versus Clemson to start our ACC play, our first ever conference game. And then we'll be hosting North Carolina as well. Taking on Wake Forest in Wake Forest Stadium. And hosting Florida State in Week 7. At Duke in Week 8. At Virginia Tech in Week 10. Week 11, we'll be hosting NC State. Then we'll have Navy in Week 12. Virginia Week 13. And Army to finish out the season. Our first game is televised. We're going to be taking on Air Force. I'm pretty excited about this one. We're starting the season ranked 24th in the country, and I do believe we are a four-star program now. Um, with the win in the bowl game and the added uh, joining, you know, the ACC conference. So, let me get this shared in the Discord, and we will get into some games, folks. I'm excited. Let's go. Let's do it. Right, all shared, ready to go. See who we got in the chat. We got a Marvin Joseph. What's going on, brother? Don't forget to slap the like button, guys. Subscribe if you're new. Let's go ahead. We'll take a look at the Sports Illustrated. I think we already did this in the previous stream. Take a look at the conference outlook. Now, I figured we're a four-star program. Since Wake Forest is a five-star, and they're right above us in conference standings. And then Virginia is four-star, and they're right below us. So we got to be at least a four- or a five-star school right now. I would assume that we are a four-star program. Unfortunately, our stars are white, and we can't see them. So there's a spot that we can see. I just cannot remember where in Dynasty. But let's go and take on the Air Force Falcons week one. Let's get it. Here's the matchup. B minus overall for the Falcons. B overall for the Patriots. Let's go. I'm ready. Hopefully we got a packed stadium to start off the season. We're just about 40,000 uh, average attendance. And we're going to go all blacks to start the year. Let's go. We're on TV. Still get you that Georgia Tech was bad enough to be the one kicked out of the ACC when, <laughs> when Duke exists. Yeah, I know, man. It's crazy. I thought for sure we'd replace Duke, for sure. I wish they had it to where they could have just added us without taking out a team. That way... The ACC could have 12 teams in it right now, and we could have a ACC title game and everything like that. That would have been really cool. Tyler Rocky in the chat. What's up, Tyler? Andre Savage leading the Patriots out on the field. I went ahead and gave a bunch of our freshman players some swag, some nice equipment. Wow, we're not even halfway up the middle deck right now? What? I know Air Force isn't a great team, but this is opening week, fellas. Come on. Gotta pack the stands. That's crazy to me. Alright. We're getting the ball first. And we're scoring. All right? We're doing it. 
Jason Landry and Darius Curtis back deep to return the opening kickoff of season four. Curtis from the four yard line. Oh, nice blocking. Good tackle though at the 28 yard line. And DeMarco McKelvey will lead the team onto the field for the first time. Got, what, three true freshman halfbacks that we'll be seeing quite a bit of. The starter is Stevenson. And McKelvey is just going to take the opening play for about four or five yards. Let's give it off to, oh my goodness, my controller. Trying to do a fullback blast. I guess we're uh, I guess we're gonna throw it here on, <laughs> on this play. Controller's going crazy. I don't like this play. Somehow got a first down out of it. All right, now let's try to hand it off to the fullback. My left analog stick was going crazy. Goodness, Sapp, the big fullback, he is quick. I believe he's got 80 speed. I'm excited to see what he can do this season. Trying to fill the shoes of Danny Roxon, who just had a 20 touchdown season. Well, 21 total, but 20 on the ground. Oh my goodness. Stevenson breaking a tackle, okay. Didn't know how to work it into the games back then. Yeah, that makes sense. Way back in this era of video games. It'd be kind of hard to do custom conferences and whatnot. Hand it off to Stevenson again here. He's not very shifty, but he's really strong. He can stiff arm some guys. Break some tackles. I did forget to do some formation subs. I want to get all three of the young running backs on the field. Get them all some carries every game. I get their option here. Oh my goodness. The blocking was amazing right there. First down and 10 from the 36 yard line. Receivers are not great for us. A good center. And obviously a good quarterback. Okay, Walker. Way to come back for it, buddy. First pass attempt of the season. Goes for eight yards. I'm going to try a corner route. We don't really throw them too often. But I want to try to hit McCall. That's the walk-on receiver. Well, McCall. Oh, it hit him in the hands, too. That's all good. All right, third down and two. I'm going to go ISO. Let one of the uh, young, young guys in the backfield get a carry. And that should be close to the marker. And they're going to give him the first down. I plan on streaming for quite some time today, so strap yourselves in, folks. Here we go. Get you back. Stevenson. Get him some more yards. He's got 20 already on the first drive. And he's tired, so we're probably going to see the number two halfback come in, number 34. And that is Christensen. I picked a draw play, so we'll see if this actually does anything here. Okay, Stevenson or Christensen breaking tackles, getting it inside the 10 yard line. First and goal coming up. Surprised the draw play actually worked. Oh, 
fullback missed his block. Come on, young fella. We need you. All right, second and goal from the nine. It's been a great drive so far. Oh, he missed him. McKelvey breaks the sack attempt. But can't deliver to the receiver. Third and goal coming up now. Dang it. McKelvey. Oh, he's tired. Dang it. Not sure why he's so tired. He didn't do a whole lot on that drive running the ball. Gonna have to settle for a field goal. Mills is the kicker. Over Godfrey Barnes. This is his first career field goal attempt. I missed it badly. No, maybe not. Nope, I did. I think they hit the crossbar. Oh my goodness. Or just hooked a lot. All right, a lot of fresh faces on defense. Let's see, we got Samson at D tackle. That's the only change on D line. We got Norwood at middle linebacker, Walden. Landry's over on the left side now. Johnson is the free safety. And I believe Stevens is our starting strong safety. And Washington, the new Washington, five-star freshman, is on the right side at corner. And around, and that goes nowhere. And I believe, let's see, who is that, Walden? Pretty sure it was Walden. Nice play by Washington. Gave him number two. Swagged him out a little bit with some equipment. <coughs> Third down 13 coming up. Quick pass. Incomplete. There's a flag for holding. So a good stop by the defense. We'll get the ball back for the offense. Hopefully we can get in the end zone this time. Not have to try a field goal, which I just really love to do. I don't understand why, why we don't have a packed house right now for opening week. Probably for the Clemson game, though. All right, their secondary is pretty bad. Let's see if we can test them. Big dog, big dog. Throw it out to the fullback and hits him. Awesome. Three DBs on the right side for this triple option play. And Stevenson fighting forward to the 39-yard line. And McKelvey close, but there's holding anyway. That's on one of the freshman linemen. All 
I don't understand why McKelvey's just so tired already in this game. They're down 13 coming up for the Patriots. And we get sacked and fumble it. And the ref gets in my way. So I can't recover it. Awesome. Great start to the season. Let's go, Stevens. The freshman. Oh, he might be gone. Stevens to the 50, to the 40, the 30. Finally dragged out of bounds around the 28-yard line. Let's go. The user interception, baby. Love it. I read that play so good. To the walk-on receiver, touchdown Marine Corps Patriots. Let's go. Oh, that was pretty. What a throw from DeMarco McKelvey. What a turn of events. My, how the tables have turned, or the turns of table. Beautiful. Go from fumbling it, giving them great field position, to scoring a play later. That's awesome. Our walk-on punter boots it deep. And the defense back out on the field. Oh, nice play. Dominique Mullins with the tackle for a loss. Called the blitz and it worked to perfection. They can't hear anything right now. Well, at least the fullback can't. That back ISO. And Stevens, nice tackle through traffic. This guy's going to be good. And that's the end of the first quarter. Marine Corps Patriots on top. 7-0 over the Air Force Falcons here in Monaco, Virginia. They're down three, coming up. Fullback dive. And looks like they got it. All right, let's send a couple linebackers here on the blitz. Got man coverage across the board. Guys, open. Nice deflection by Jason Landry, the now junior cornerback. Part of our first recruiting class. Pullback dive again. And then Rose this time gets maybe a yard off the left side. Norm Blunt on the tackle. We have six new starters on defense this season. Let's see if they can maintain that number one spot. Oh, he's open, but a big overthrow from the quarterback. That was a designed screen pass to the halfback, and they decided to try to go for the shot. Couldn't quite connect on it.
Curtis to return it. Come on, Curtis. And there's a flag for clipping. Good times. And that's on the freshman, Stevens. So we're going to start this drive at the 23-yard line. Wait, they declined that? Or did I decline it? Wait, was that on them? I'm so confused. Stevenson up the gut. Gets three or four yards. I'm liking the ground attack so far. It's working out pretty well. I'm going to go fullback dive. See if he can't get into the second level like he did on his first carry. Man. Once we get this O-line trained up and just a little bit better, these running plays are going to work so much better. If that guard had blocked for just a split second longer, Sap could still be running. Third down and three. Our option. And McKelvey jukes out the free safety, gets the first down. He's up to 20 yards in the game. Goodness gracious, I don't even know how McKelvey got that past the line of scrimmage. Good call by Air Force's coach, though. Blitzing the perfect spot. All right, what do I want to do here? Couple hot routes. A little play action. Oh, nice deflection. Man, if, if McKelvey got more air under that pass, that could have been a touchdown. Third down and 10 coming up instead. Deflection at the line. Oh my goodness. Well, first punt of the season for Jerome, <laughs> the uh, walk on punter. I think that's how you pronounce it. That's going to go way to the right. Come on, McKnight. Do something, buddy. Oh my goodness. That's, that's not what I meant when I said do something. Good tackle by Lure. Tackle there from Darius Curtis. No, that was Dominique Mullins. Kelby, two for eight so far. That's rough. Let's go, defense. Oh, nice hit. By Norwood, the middle linebacker, drawing the ball loose. And that'll bring up third down and four yards to go. Let's go, Monster Green. Man coverage. I got Holt. Set up a screen. That's a backwards pass, and they do recover it. And that counts as a sack fumble. And they're going to punt it away again. Air Force is having a rough time today. But so are we. Just trying to find, find what works on offense so far in the game. Which the ground game's been working. 
70 yards rushing so far in the game. Two corners on the right side. And just get the yard. Six or seven up the middle for McKelvey. Let's go fullback blast. There you go, Sap, getting the first down, big fella. Try to hit him with a play-action play here. Come on, get there. Oh, it hit him in the hands again. <laughs> Come on, Simon. Notre Dame beat Michigan State 66 to what? What did that say? Oh, my goodness. And we have Notre Dame next, so that should be fun. <laughs> Good lordy. Ooh, the spin move and a broken tackle. Okay, Stevenson. Hugh Whitney injured his chest on the play. He's also invisible on the screen. They're down in six coming up. Eric Tavares in the chat. What up, Eric? What's going on, buddy? Oh, boy. And McKelvey gets close to the sticks. I don't think he got it, though. Fourth and one, we're going for it. Just regular old halfback ISO. Let's go, Stevenson. See what you're made of, freshman. And you move the chains. Maybe Michigan stays 66 to 19. Oh my word. That's insane. It's not like Michigan State is a slouch, you know? They're a decent school. Good tackle. 39 yards on the ground for McKelvey in the game. Nine carries. He Whitney out for two quarters with an abdominal strain. Alex McKnight injured on the play. Oh my goodness, he got hurt in blocking. That is unfortunate. And we're third down and two situation here. From the 38. Two for six on third down in the game. And Sapp will move the chains again for us. Play action. What was that? He literally stopped moving. Oh my goodness. Should have been a nice play. Second down and ten now. go oh good run from Christensen the freshman is gone oh my goodness what a cutback 35 yard run for number 34 that was pretty been a while since we've seen one of our running backs do something like that usually it's McKelvey Nice 
nice. And so far, we got a touchdown pass to a walk-on wide receiver and a touchdown run of 35 yards for a freshman halfback. And on defense, we had an almost a pick six for our freshman strong safety, Stevens. So a lot of new faces out here already making plays for the program. Nice deflection by Stevens. Just hoping I can get another pick with him. Just 40 seconds left here in the first half. Pullback dive. See if we can't get another stop and maybe get the ball back again. And coverage, All right, fullback. And I'll hand it off to him, and he is going to get the first down. And now Air Force will call the timeout as they're looking to get something going on offense. Nice throw. Fox with the catch. On the 38-yard line of the Marine Corps. Come on, defense. Make a play. Oh, nice hit by Walden. So far, four hurries and a sack, plus an interception for the defense. And we get the sack again. Let's go. It was Walden, the freshman. A lot of young guys are stepping up already. And we're going to get him again. Walden, back-to-back -back sacks for the freshman. Let's go. And they're just going to chuck it up to end the first half. Just five seconds left. He's pressured, and he's going to be sacked again. Kwame Gatewood gets him this time. We have four sacks in the first half against the Air Force Falcons. It's 14-0 as we head into the locker rooms. I'm going to go ahead and go into formation subs real quick and get some of our young halfbacks some more opportunities here. I want to see Smith in there. All right, there we go. Get all the young guys the ball. And pretty decent kickoff to about the six-yard line. Kicker gets in on the hit, too. If we win this game, it'll be, what, 13 straight wins. Which is insane. And Stevens forces a fumble, and the true freshman corner... Recovers it. Oh my goodness. Beautiful start here to the second half. Stevens with a pick and a forced fumble. Simon up top, and we got him. Touchdown, Patriots. McKelvey with his second of the game. DB had no idea what was happening. Yeah. 
Extra point from Mills is up, and it is good. 21-0 in the third quarter. Get it, boys. All right, back to defense. Crowd still in it. Got five bars. Pull back dive. Rose trying to get to the outside. Cuts it back for a few more yards. Give it to the fullback. Tommy Gatewood gets the tackle this time. Third down and five coming up for the Falcons. Counter. Oh, I got destroyed in the secondary, but we got the stop anyway. Norm Blunt, his fourth tackle of the game. Man, they only have four rushing yards. They're kind of getting bodied up front. And that punt is out of bounds. Get the ball to start the drive at around the 37-yard line. Get the ball to the fullback. Dang, one on one. Good tackle by the linebacker. Kelby. Nice tackle. Man. McKelvey could have been gone. Good tackle by the corner. Alright, gonna give it off to the third string halfback, Smith. See what he can do. Got one corner on the left. So I'm gonna move the tight end over. Give him a little extra help on that side. Oh, he's a little shiftier than the other guys. Oh, my goodness. Maybe a lot more shiftier. Oh, my goodness gracious. Very quick. Nice to have some running backs in the backfield now instead of just having one guy do it all. Right side of the line got blown up on that play. Hundred and seventy nine rushing yards so far in the ball game. Throwing it deep. Oh, nice deflection. That's for the backup tight end with 3 of 12. 66 yards and two touchdowns. Unreal. And we got third down and nine coming up. See, on the touchdown passes that we've thrown, I mean, those, those throws were money. All these other throws today are just not it. They're just not doing well. Man, just take off. Dang it. Really well defended play. I doubt we're going to make this field goal, but let's try it. 
Mills on for his second try of the game. 39-yard attempt. I had no accuracy again. That's a miss. But he does have the power for a 39-yarder. So we do have that going for us. Just got to get the accuracy down. Continuing to throw the ball. And Landry tips it up. Almost picked off. Cut the kicker. <laughs> Listen, Eric. We got two kickers. Neither of them are very good. Okay? Our freshman... Our true freshman walk-on punter that we got is better than both our kickers. He's got like a 78 overall. It's kind of crazy. Oh my goodness, Landry, another deflection. His fourth of the game. Just so pretty. Third down and ten, just like that. Oh my goodness, we get a deflection at the line of scrimmage. Let's go. Is that Walden? He is having himself one heck of a game right now. Couple sacks, some deflection. Oh my. Pretty good punt, kept it away from Curtis. <coughs> Excuse me. Gonna have to keep trying to run the football, I guess. Throwing it is not working out too well. Oh my goodness, Christensen. Wow. The truck stick before it existed. I would like to get oh, uh, what's his name? Shannon Sutherland, our freshman quarterback in here at some point. See what he can do as well. He'll probably be the starter next season. Nice tackle by the linebacker. McKelvey gets crushed. Smith now in there at halfback. Third down and four. Oh, good run from McKelvey. First down inside the 45 yard line of Air Force. Fullback blast time. Oh my goodness, nice tackle. Again, we're crushing our opponent in time of possession. Which helps out our defense so much for yards allowed and all that fun stuff. Yeah. Oh, nice tackle. Tight end couldn't hold his block for more than, you know, point oh one seconds. And we have third down and seven. take the first down and just slide. I had X open over the middle, but they kind of got through. And Smith will pick up five yards. All of our running backs having some pretty decent success so far in the game. Yeah. Zap. 
running people over. And he'll get seven in the first down. Let's go, big fella. I'm going to try a toss play. This could be a disaster. Oh, nice blocking. 52 yards for Christensen and a touchdown today. I'm not sure who number nine is. Win. But he's in at fullback. And we'll get him a carry. And a first down up to the five yard line. Who is this guy? Sap was tired, so. We, we let the other guy on the field. Oh, nice juke. Stevenson up to the two yard line. And that is going to end the third quarter. Get your fours up in the chat. We're on top 21 to nothing over Air Force here in Quantico, Virginia. Been a pretty, pretty easy game for us so far. Xavier Green in the chat. What up, Xavier? And Sap will punch it in. The fullback gets his first career touchdown run. That's a touchdown by, let's see, three new players got touchdowns today. Christensen, Sapp, and McCall, the walk-on wide receiver. That was a 12-play, 61-yard touchdown drive. Took 337 off the clock. Early stream this morning. Yeah, I figured I'd start one up around noon Eastern time, you know, play a bunch of games. I don't know how many we're going to play. At least four. If I'm feeling good after that fourth one, we'll just keep going. What rank are we? We are 24th, Tyler. 24th in the country. We got Notre Dame after this game, who just beat Michigan State 66 to 19, I believe. Eric said it was. Craziness. Oh, almost picked it off. Dang. Very close. That would have been Johnson's first career pick. Our front seven has been crushing these guys all game long. Nah, I'm not transferring the draft classes from this one. This is just a standalone series. Tossing it out. Oh, nice play. Let's go. Washington on the tackle. The freshman corner. The five-star player. The blue chip prospect. And we get the ball back. Yeah, eventually, uh, I'm going to go back to NCAA 04, finish up the Tar Heels dynasty, and then we will do an actual college dynasty in 05, and that will have, obviously, a Madden franchise alongside of it with imported draft classes. It's usually how we do it. All right, I'm going to give McKelvey one more drive here today.
He's got 87 yards on the ground. Man, number 60 is a big boy for us, our right guard. My goodness. Okay, Christensen, just carry the whole defense. That's fine. We do got to work on our passing a little bit because uh, I don't know if we're going to be able to run the football a whole lot against Notre Dame. To Simon, just over his hands. We've only got like three completions in the game. It's terrible. Throw it up to Simon. Hey, we got one. Let's go. First down. Two yards for Simon in the game with a touchdown. And Stevenson fights forward inside the 25 yard line. He's got 48 yards in the game, four yards per carry. Second down and seven coming up. To the fullback. Oh, he drops it. The safety went for the big hit on him, too. All right, third down and seven. McCall, the walk-on receiver with his second catch, and it's a first down. Beautiful. Christensen, and he's in again. His second touchdown of the game. Man, I'm loving these young running backs. Get at least three seasons of these guys? I'm pretty happy about that. Eight play, 57 yard drive, took a minute 44 off the clock. And it's 35 nothing. Put Shannon Sutherland in there, three-star freshman quarterback for the last four minutes of the game. I'm sure we'll get at least one more offensive possession. See what he can do. That kick's going way to the left. Air Force is just not good. Stevens gets the tackle at the 30. Fullback Rose averaging five yards per carry today. He's been probably the brightest spot on their entire team. Hopefully we can just finish out this game, get no injuries, and move on to Notre Dame. I'm looking forward to that. It should be a good game.
screen. His name's Bacon. We have six hurries, four sacks, and a pick today. Great showing from the defense. Our ground attack was working on offense. Passing attack worked when it wanted to. Got a few touchdowns out of it. Got to be more consistent throwing the ball, though. That's going to cost us some games. Third down and six coming up. Nice deflection from either Landry or Mullins. I'm not sure who exactly got a hand on it. But we'll see Shannon Sutherland lead the offense out on the field for the first time in his career. And we'll start the drive from the 20. They want a week off tackle. Let's go, coach. Let's we'll coach pick the plays unless it's something crazy for the last two minutes. And Stevenson up to the 27 yard line. He's got 55 on the game. Close to the first down. And he did move the chains. All right. And they want a week off tackle again. All right, coach. Digging deep in the playbook, I see. And Stevenson will get five or six more yards up the middle. Fullback over. All right. See how well this one works. And Sapp close to the marker again. And Donnell Sapp injured his knee on the play. That is not good at all. Christensen, player of the game for the Patriots. Eight carries, 75 yards, two touchdowns. All right, freshman. That's the tight end getting the carry, and he'll move the chains. All right, I do want to run a triple option here. With Sutherland, just to see what the young guys got. Sap will be out for the rest of the game, which is totally fine. Stuck on my own right guard. That was a right tackle out there making a play. What? What is going on? Okay, Sutherland. Okay. That was a slow spin move, but it worked. And we moved the chains again. Do one more play and get out of here with a shutout victory over Air Force. Total smackdown here today. And that is it. Week one is in the books, folks. 35-0 win over our rivals, the Air Force Falcons. I mean, they, they couldn't do anything. That was pathetic. They're not really built to throw the football, and our front seven was just crushing them up front. The fullback had, what, 40, 50 yards maybe? But none of the halfbacks could get in the open field and make any of our guys miss. So that was just, we just crushed their, their game plan from the start.
Is that back-to-back -back shutouts? Didn't we shut out Stanford in the bowl game? They had 86 yards of offense. They only had the ball for 38 plays. We had the ball for 70 plays. 314 rushing yards for us. Only 90 passing, though. 7 of 12 on third down. We missed two field goals in the red zone. Obviously, got to work on that still. I'm trying. Almost double their time. No, it was double their time of possession. We had 19-20. Dang. That is crazy. McKelvey to McCall to start off the scoring. Christensen with a 35-yard run. McKelvey to Simon. Two-yard run by Sapp. And Christensen got his second of the day. 5 of 16. That is awful. But no picks today. Only sacked one time. So the O-line has improved a little bit. A lot of guys got a lot of carries here today. Akeem Smith, 2 for 24. I'd like to get him a couple more carries per game than that. But really, really good performance all the way around, I think. And nobody allowed a sack. Norm Blunt and LJ Carroll both had six tackles. John Stevens had five. Bunch of tackles for a loss. Walden was going crazy for a little bit there. Two sacks back to back. Gatewood had one. LJ Carroll had one. John Stevens had the pick for a 65 yard return. Four deflections for Landry. Four fumble for Stevens. One for Carroll. One recovered by Albert Washington. The five-star blue chip corner, the number one recruit in the country, making his presence known. And Chris Mills, over two kicking. Feels bad. And a 51-yard punt return for Darius Curtis in the game. Why do I not remember that? And now, we get to go take on... The Notre Dame Fighting Irish in South Bend, Indiana. This should be a great game. Of course, we're going to save the game first. You know, got to do it. Drinking a Red Bull and uh, Lipton Green Tea Citrus. It's pretty good. All right, we did not move in the standings at all. Notre Dame is 22nd in the country. This is the game of the week. So, get hype. Let's go. Top 25 matchup. I wish this was in our stadium, though. Just because it would probably be a packed house. Or at least fans up in the upper decks, which we've only seen one other time. Should be a good game, though. Let's go, Patriots! Woo! After this, we start our ACC play. Our first ever conference game will be against Clemson. And then, who was it after that? North Carolina, I believe? Those should be some good games. We've won 13 straight now. Our last defeat was at the hands of the Akron Zips in week one last season. I still cannot believe how poorly we played in that game, too. Alright. Here is the matchup. Notre Dame put up 671 yards of offense against Michigan State. 
only allowed 283. Goodness gracious. 66 points. 412 rushing yards. 259 passing. Oh my goodness. Michigan State, what happened? I mean, you guys aren't that bad. B minus overall? Notre Dame just a B overall. Man, you guys got destroyed. Wow. And they are right on the cover. So hopefully we can beat them and get ourselves on the cover, which we have not been on before. I like how they have us on the top 25 pulls, but in the wrong uniform. We wore our all-black unis. And the beat goes on. The Patriots' win streak is up to 13 games after their season-opening victory. McKelvey is on the Heisman watch list. He's probably not going to win it, though. No way. See, now that we're in a conference, we're getting a lot more recognition, like, everywhere. Clemson, just a three-star program right now. I'm pretty sure we're a four-star team. All right, let's get it. South Bend, Indiana, here we come, baby. Arizona just beat BYU 78 to 35. What? Yo, know, some of these scores are insane in this game. I love it. Alright, what's Notre Dame wearing? You know what? I want them to wear the greens. Alright? You guys wear the greens, we'll wear red. Let's do it. This should be lit. They are without their center. Not sure if he's a starter or not. Senior halfback. Had four touchdowns last week. How do we move conferences? Well, you missed the last stream. But it was literally right after I got done talking about I'm only going to accept a conference invite to a big conference. And like two minutes later, we got an invite for the ACC, we replaced Georgia Tech. So now we get to go out here and try to win some conference championships, which will help in our quest for national championships. Ooh, this red versus green is gonna be awesome. Let's go. I love Notre Dame's green unis. They're beautiful. All right, boys. This is a huge game right now. We're kicking it. Let's go. Is that Tom Zivakowski, number nine? My controller is going crazy right now. And I got a perfect kick to start the game. Let's go. Into the end zone. Oh, baby. Woohoo. Let's go. Get him. All right, fellas. Tom Zivakowski on the opening kick return up to the 20. All right, they're going to go three receivers set to start off. I'm on Gatewood for some reason. And they have a scrambling quarterback. All right. Our freshman corner could be a starting shooting guard for the Lakers. He's that tall. Let's see if I can get on my guy this time. Here we go. Dawson it out. Get him. Good play. 
Who's that, Walden? Yes, sir. Freshman outside linebacker. Man, these colors look so good together on the field. Get him. Landry, what are you doing? Got to make that play, buddy. Oh, man coverage here. Nice tackle from Norm Blunt, the defensive end. We should have had that pick. We got to capitalize on bad plays like that. Third down and seven. Big time play coming up. Ain't no way that's going to be caught, right? There we go. All right, so we get the stop. Fourth and seven from our 49 yard line. They're going to punt it away. ball at the 18 yard line to start our first drive of the game. I'm going to go weak off tackle. Stadium Pulse is all the way up. Oh baby, number 12 toughest in the country. Run Stevenson. Good run to start the game. Love it. Let's go. You have NCAA Hoops 05 to make the USMC Academy's basketball team. Nice. That'd be fun. Oh my goodness, I don't know how Christensen got out of that. Yeah, I have, um, what is it, NCAA Basketball 10 for the PS3. I got that one. Sat getting a few yards up the middle, the big fullback, the freshman. They're down and one. Crowd going crazy. Kelby, easy. Let's go. Outrun him. Still getting pushed. Oh my goodness, what a run from DeMarco McKelvey, the senior quarterback. Beautiful run. I'm going to try to hit him with play action. Could be great, could be terrible. We'll see. Not enough blocking. That D line is probably stacked too. Navy beat Cal 53 to 39. What? Yeah, I got a feeling that defensive line is insane. Well, at least the 1D tackle, 1 defensive end are really good. Second and 22 coming up now. 
God dang it. Underthrown to Simon. Now third and long. Let's go, boys. To the walk-on. Oh, my goodness. He mossed him inside the 20. Let's go. Lead McCall, baby. No way. 78 overall. Is he 78 overall? Or is that the punter? Either way, walk-on receiver. Making a big-time catch on third and 22. I love it. I'll get that block. Get it. Kelby down to the four yard line. This is a good drive. Gotta get in the end zone though. Let's go boys. Punch it in. Down to the two is Stevenson. Just inside the two yard line. Switch it to the right side. And Stevenson down inside the one yard line now. Oh, we're so close. Third and goal. Let's go. Sap is in. Touchdown, Patriots. We get the lead. Let's go. What a drive. Sap with his second touchdown run of the season. Extra point from Mills is up, and it is good. 7-0 here in South Bend, Indiana. 11 play, 82-yard drive. Took 312 off the clock. And even on kickoff, my controllers are still going crazy from the stadium pulse. Another nice return, and there's a face mask. It's a five yarder. All right, defense, let's get it. Nice play by Washington. Just a two yard pickup for the Irish. Oh, we get the sack. Let's go. Who got him? That was Sampson. No, it was Carroll. Defensive end. Gets another one. Quarterback a little indecisive there. Cost him a sack. Third and 14 coming up. And we get another sack. They tried to set up the screen. And Kwame Gatewood goes in unblocked. Oh my goodness. Fourth and 23 now. Yeah. 
and they're going to punt it out of bounds at the 45-yard line. So we're in good field position to start this drive. Oh my goodness. Immediate pressure from the left end, Murray. And McKelvey goes down. No stadium pulse and still can't hear the play. So I'm not throwing to Simon. Because he doesn't know where the play is going. Throw the ball, McKelvey. What are you doing? Oh, boy. Hey, he should have thrown that. I don't know why he brought it back into his body. That is unacceptable. That is going to be the end of the first quarter, though. We're on top of the Notre Dame Fighting Irish 7-0 here in South Bend, Indiana. Third and very long. 17 yards to go. Lee McCall. Oh, he just missed him. That would have been amazing if he caught another third and very long. Said we got a punt. Walk on punter. On for the punt. Should be a pretty decent one. Out around the 20, 21 yard line maybe. I wonder if that counts as inside the 20, even though it's just past the 20. Put back draw. And a nice tackle from Stevens. Freshman making a nice play from the secondary. It's crazy that we have three brand new starters, all true freshmen, in the secondary. It's awesome. Just overthrown. Was that Jeff Samarja? Or was he 83? Pretty sure he was 83. Do I remember Wrestling Cup Classic? I do. I never forgot. Come on, ref, get out of the way. Good tackle. Oh my goodness. Jason Landry on the stop. And they're going to punt it away. Oh my goodness, run Curtis. Woo, oh that was beautiful. Not a whole lot, uh, a lot of offense in this game so far. 75 for us, 26 for them. Defenses came to play. He's doing MMA now, nice. Oh no. Oh, my goodness. Well, that happened. Dang it all the heck. Can't challenge Eric. Second down, three. Come 
Juwan Johnson. Nice deflection for the five-star free safety. Irish, zero for three on third down tries today. And they're going to get this one with the halfback, number 36. Irish trying to put together a drive for the first time today. Deflection for Johnson. Blitz a couple linebackers on this play. Walden, Norwood. Draw. Get him. And he's going to get a couple yards. Parker Thomas in the chat. What up, Parker? What's up, brother? They're down at eight coming up. And we stop them again. Not sure what kind of play that was, but... I'll take the stop, and they're going to punt it away to Darius Curtis once again. Start the drive around the 21, 22-yard line. Front seven's pretty dang good. All right, let's see what we got here. Let's go slot post. Big night. Oh, no. We got lucky. I should have threw that a split second earlier. Offense is a bit rough right now. Come on, Walker, get open over the middle. Nope. Oh my goodness, he's fast. Wow. Well, looks like we're punting it away again. Goodness gracious. Definitely going to be a low scoring affair here in this game. Good punt from the walk on. Good tackle from Washington. Let's go, buddy. Tom Zibakowski on the return. Decent run for number 36. Not sure why they haven't tried to throw the football a little bit more. Nice tackle. Let's go, Norm. Oh my 
goodness. Walden with the deflection. Quarterbacks are combined 3 of 13 for 53 yards. And that was, I didn't even realize that was third down. My goodness. Already the fifth punt of the game for Brandon. Come on, Sap. Nope. Oh, he almost caught it off the deflection. That would have been crazy. This could be decent. We get the blocking. We did not really get all the blocking. Everybody let go of their guy. Every time. Third down and seven, or third and eight, rather. And Notre Dame calls the timeout. Two minutes left. McCall wide open, and the walk-on receiver moves the chains. Let's go. McKnight, one on one, get him! Oh, nice deflection for Zibikowski. Man, we've been sacked four times in this game. We only got sacked once against Air Force. Neither team over a hundred yards of offense yet. Easy first down for McKelvey. Come on, Simon. Get there, brother. Dang it. So hard trying to find something that's going to work. Oh, nice spin move. And there's a flag for holding. Second down and 18 now after the penalty. Come on, Simon. Let's go, baby. First down. Got the one-on-one -on -one matchup that we wanted out there. And 
there's Simon again, moving the chains. Let's go. No huddle. Oh, nice deflection at the line. Simon was open again. Dang it. Dang it all to heck. Second and ten. Up top to the tight end. Touchdown, Patriots. Let's go. What a throw. What a catch. And we got the two-score lead with 29 seconds left in the first half. Beautiful. Beat the linebacker up the seam. Extra point is good. It's 14 to nothing. 11 plays, 78 yards, 202 off the clock on that drive. We have not been scored on in what seems like 10 years. Oh, nice tackle. Let's go. And that's the end of the first half. We're on top 14 to 0. Over the 22nd ranked Notre Dame Fighting Irish here in South Bend, Indiana. Let's go, Curtis. Try to get our ground game working. Oh, that's a nice run for Christensen. Eight or nine yards up the middle. Fullback blast time. First down. Ten first downs in the game for the Marine Corps. Oh my goodness, this spin is so fast. Come on, Simon, one on one, buddy. Oh, we couldn't get it. Brings up a third and seven. Let's 
get all the blockers on the left side. And we do not get it. Good stop for the Irish. Goodness, Zibikowski just running over everybody. Wow. Runs over a five-star corner. <laughs> Completely destroys our tight end. Good return. Draw. Get him. Nice run. They've only thrown the ball like four times that I can remember. Oh, Norwood, you gotta pick that, buddy. Four. And Norm Blunt stops him short of the marker. Let's go. My goodness. They just cannot sustain a drive. Come on, Curtis. Oh, we got blocking. Nice return to around the 47-yard line. Let's go, Walker. Beautiful throw and catch. Wow. Let's go. Perfect wheel route. I'll try to hit a corner route. The call. Oh my goodness. Act five times in the game. I'm gonna try option pass. And I'm just gonna have to take off for a couple yards. Those plays do work, but I can't have the right guard get blocked back into me like that. Third and 14. We're five for eight in the game. McCall over the middle doesn't get the first down. Let's try field goal. We're bound to make one eventually, right? Stadium going crazy to make it a three score game. Kick is up, and it's good. 17 0 here in the third quarter. so nice to actually make a field goal for once. Right. 
Ryan Stevens. What a tackle. Oh, my goodness. This young secondary is going to be really good for the next three years. Taking off. And Stevens with a nice open field tackle. Irish just one of seven on third down. Taking off again? Oh my goodness. And that's a sack. I don't know what they're doing. They don't know what they're doing. And their punter is not very good. kidding me? That's a defensive tackle. I want to see that again. That's terrible. I never said that year five was going to be the final year, Tyler. There's a pick for the Irish. McKelvey gets the tackle. Sanchez, outside linebacker with the pick. Do that way too late. Finally threatening to get some points on the board. option. I got ran over, but Washington made a nice tackle. And now Walden is injured, our freshman outside linebacker. That's unfortunate. Who do we have to take over for him is Hartley, another young linebacker. Quarterback's taken off and push him out of bounds with Stevens. Irish, one of eight on third down. Needs seven yards for this one. Quarterback draw, and we stopped him. Oh my goodness, Kwame Gatewood on the tackle. That'll bring up fourth down, but we're heading into the fourth quarter. Get your fours up in the chat, folks. Can we hang on for the dub here in South Bend, Indiana, as the Irish 
are going to go for it on fourth down here. We need six yards from the 12. And they got it. Oh, my goodness. That was Washington's guy. We finally allow some points. It had been, what, 11 quarters since we allowed any kind of points. Not even 100 yards of offense for Notre Dame, not 200 for the Marine Corps. Four-star commander in the chat. What's up, brother? All right, it's 17-7. Curtis from the nine yard line. Oh, nice tackle. And I feel like we can get a kick return touchdown. You know? I think we could. Maybe not today, but sometime soon. We're just missing like one, maybe two blocks. And I think we can spring one free. Stevenson picking up five yards up the middle. Only 18 yards for him in the game. But we've only given him the ball just a handful of times. Well, Walden out for four weeks with a bruised shoulder. So that's a pretty significant loss to the linebacking core. We'll have to have Hartley out there instead. Here we go. Smith. Oh, no, he did not. Wow. <laughs> what is going on right now? No way. Notre Dame trying to fight their way back into this one. Oh, just a simple routine tackle. And Smith coughs it up. No way. Taken off. Pushed him out of bounds. I'm going to put a quarterback spy on him now. It's going to be Norwood. No, actually, I'm going to switch it up to Mullins. He's a lot faster than Norwood is. Counter. Good tackle, Stevens. Let's go. Come on, defense. Do something. Nice tackle by Hartley. Only 18 combined first downs in the game. That's crazy. Blunt gets the stop around the line of scrimmage. Second down and eight coming up. Five minutes left in the contest. And we're up by ten. Nice 
Nice spin move to cut back inside. And it's third down three. Monster Green, man coverage. Let's go. This is already their 10th trip to the red zone this season. They're tossing it. Oh, perfect blocking. Oh, my goodness. I got crushed. First and goal from the three. Notre Dame trying to make it a one score ball game. Up the middle and touchdown Notre Dame. They close the gap. Only going to be down by a field goal after the extra point. Yep, Notre Dame does have momentum, that's for sure. Two straight turnovers by our offense has definitely not helped us out here. And there it is, 17-14 is the score here in the fourth quarter. Four oh nine left in the game. Oh my goodness, Landry, what are you doing? Are you kidding me right now? Wow, the shenanigans. Cannot believe that just happened. We're back at our seven yard line. And McKelvey gets a big hit. Unreal. Second down and nine. And we're just going to get the first down, McKelvey. Stay in bounds. Try to run the clock out as much as we can. And Sapp will get maybe a yard or two up the middle on the triple option. We got Clemson after this one. It's the start of our conference play in the ACC. Oh my goodness, the right guard just got thrown. Option right on third and eight. Just over two remaining in the game. McKelvey, first down and more. Just hang on to the ball, young fella. Keep moving the chains. Man, look at the offensive totals. Like, there's not a lot of offense in this game at all. Stay in balance, Christensen. There you go, buddy. 
Only 21 yards for him in the game. Notre Dame finally starting to call some timeouts. They got two left. Pitch it out. Go, Christensen. Look at McKelvey out here trying to block. And he does. Christensen cuts it back inside of the 35. McKelvey downfield throwing blocks. I love it. And he actually blocked number 91. Right. 128 remaining. And hand this off to Stevenson, left side. And he got nothing. But we're going to keep the clock moving. Gatewood, player of the game for the Patriots. Middle linebacker number 57, player of the game for the Irish. Second and 10. And that is another first down for the Patriots. Let's go. Going to be able to ice this game. Walk out of here with a three-point victory. My goodness. Turned out to be a pretty good game in the end due to some takeaways from Notre Dame's defense. Not sure why they didn't throw the football a whole lot in this game. Only 28 passing yards. They ran the ball pretty successfully against us when they had the ball. That is going to be the final play of the game, so we ice the game with some pretty crucial runs on the final drive. Just 276 yards of offense for us, 129 for Notre Dame. And we get the 17-14 victory here in South Bend, Indiana over the 22nd ranked Notre Dame Fighting Irish after they just put up 66 points on Michigan State. And that is win number 14 in a row as we head into ACC play against the Clemson Tigers next. And that's a home game. We got sacked a lot in this game. Even their defensive tackles were outrunning McKelvey. Hundred thirty three rushing yards for us, hundred and one for Notre Dame. They only threw the ball eleven times. We sacked them three times. We got sacked six. We had three turnovers, two lost fumbles and a pick. And two penalties in the game for 15 yards. Notre Dame put up 14 points there in the fourth quarter, but just wasn't enough. McKelvey, 7 of 16, 143 yards, one touchdown, one pick, sack six times, long of 37. He had 54 rushing yards today. Donald Sapp had the rushing touchdown for the offense. McKelvey and Smith both fumbled the ball. Kareem Scott with a touchdown reception. That's the tight end, the junior. No drops. Two of the freshman linemen allowing some sacks. And a redshirt senior center allowed two sacks. Stevens and Washington, both the five-star recruits. Or no, John Stevens is actually a four-star. So 
Albert Washington, five-star, blue-chip corner, number one prospect in the country. He had four tackles today. We had five total tackles for a loss, three sacks, two for Gatewood, one for Carroll. No picks. Some deflections here. Brandon Johnson is the other five-star prospect that we signed. Chris Mills, one of one field goals. And that is it for this game. Let's go ahead and see if we can beat the Clemson Tigers in our first ever conference game as we take on the ACC. Should be a good one. We'll save the game real quick. Simulate the rest of week two. See where we jump up in the rankings. Since we were just 24th, they were 22nd. I would assume we'll probably be top 20. Where did we finish at the end of last season? 14th? Or 16th? I can't remember. It was literally like two days ago. Well, we got Clemson. We got North Carolina next after that. Both home games. Hoping we can get a packed stadium for one of those games. Now, I'll most likely be streaming tomorrow as well. I'm supposed to have basketball practice, but it's supposed to rain all day tomorrow, so that's not going to happen. Alright, see you the rest of the week. Florida State wins. That's good for us. They're on our schedule. Wake Forest won. They are also on our schedule. Miami won. FIU beats Texas A&M in the Aggies Stadium. What? No way. That is insane. Golden Panthers on the rise, right? Probably not. That's still crazy, though. All right, we are 20th for this game, and it is televised. Clemson is ranked 90th in the country. Oh, my goodness. Obviously, we have the number one defense right now, only allowing 107 yards per game. Only 38 passing yards a game against us. I don't know what these teams are doing, but they're just not throwing the ball a lot. 14-game winning streak, 2-0 on the season. Let's go ahead and take a look at the Sports Illustrated. All right. Probably nobody for us. All right, so we beat Notre Dame in their stadium, and we get no recognition. Cool. Check the report card. Got to beat a five or six prestige team. Finish in top three in the ACC and beat Navy. I think we could do that. I wish you showed our conference record uh, right here on the report card, too. That'd be cool. Just shows conference titles instead. Thirty-six thousand average attendance. All right, let's get it. I'm ready. Wake Forest wins. Virginia Tech wins. Boston College crushes Navy. Rutgers destroys Stanford. Was that thirty-five to three? Oh my goodness. Miami wins again. Notre Dame crushes Penn State 52 to 21. Wow. All right, Tyler, take it easy, buddy. All right, let's get it. 
Marine Corps Patriots, Clemson Tigers, now! Alright boys, let's get this done. We're almost, oh we do have some stands, or some people in the top stands I think, right? A couple people scattered up there. Get him McClendon, good tackle. defense got six bars of stadium pulse right now love to get our stadium up into the top 25 toughest places to play that'd be awesome and oh my goodness Clemson starting it off with a pass play and they move the chains on the first play of the game They already have like half the passing yards Notre Dame had all last game. Nice deflection. Let's go. Quarterback draw, and there's a fumble, and they somehow recovered that. No way we didn't get that ball. And that was Hartley filling in for the injured Walden at outside linebacker who forced the fumble. Seven yards allowed per game by this defense so far. It's our third game of the season. Third and 11. Good pass, and Best gets the ball but does not move the chains. And they're going to punt it away. Goodness, that kicker's got a leg. All right, offense, let's try to run the football a little bit better this time around. And Christensen will get five yards.
Third and short coming up. Stevenson picks up two yards on the play. Really, I just got blocked by my own player. Still somehow got the first down. Alan Fox injured his shoulder on the play for Clemson, though. Beautiful day for football. Keep pounding the rock. And Stevenson will pick up four or five yards. I'm really liking these young running backs. Go single back, half back option. And McKelvey right up the middle. Oh my goodness. Not a linebacker in sight. Torn shoulder muscle out 11 weeks. That is rough news for Clemson. To the fullback. Oh my goodness, what a laser beam. Look at this throw. Woo. That was pretty. I can't believe Sapp actually caught it too. Kelly gets a couple up the middle. Try some corner routes. Second down and seven. Throw it up top to the tight end, and he's going to come down with it for the touchdown, Patriots. Let's go. Great throw, great catch, and we strike first. Throw it up and let your guys make the play. Two weeks in a row with a touchdown for the tight end. That was eight plays, 76 yard drive, took 223 off the clock. kicker. Oh my goodness, what a hit. I don't know who that was. Number 59. That's Hartley, I believe. Yeah, that was Hartley on the tackle. This young fella right here. Of course, they can still hear the plays. Where's he going with that? Nowhere. Great pressure by the front seven. Gonna blitz. Blitz Hartley. Off the right edge here. Oh my goodness, Johnson should have had his first career pick. Guy threw it right to him. I might get lost in the sauce over here on this side. I can't see my receiver. I got a guard. Should be interesting. Screen. And he just straight up drops it. Wow. My goodness.
Come on, Curtis. Get there. Now oh, the ref got in his way. Of course he did. Wow. Generous bounce there. Go with the power option. And no pitch. Good pressure up front from the Tigers. Nice deflection. Third down and 11. And of course, McCovey gets crushed. All right, I'm punting right back to him, I guess. That was an awful possession. Nice tackle, McKnight. Let's go, buddy. Landry with the deflection. <laughs> Quarterback draw. And Stevens brings Ellington down. I'm blitzing. I don't do it very often, but I'm doing it. And we get to stop anyway. Dominic Mullins comes through on the blitz. Stops him short. Let's go, Curtis. Then move back to the 35 yard line. That's supposed to be play action pass, but decided to hand it off instead, picking up seven yards. The fullback moving the chains. Here we go, McCall. Okay, buddy. Up to the 36-yard line. Run, McKelvey. Oh, get that block. 
McKelvey down the sideline. He's gone. Touchdown, Marine Corps. Let's go. What a run. That might be the longest run of his career. Longest touchdown run, at least. That was some beautiful blocking downfield. Was that Simon? nothing here in the first quarter our defense continues to dominate as they've done the past couple seasons doesn't help that teams are doing quarterback draws with pocket passing quarterbacks last team that did anything against our defense was Oklahoma State Ever since that game, we've been dominating. Oh my goodness. Instead of going for the catch, the receiver just trucks through the DB. And it's third down three now. Tigers zero for three on third down. And they get this one. And he runs out of bounds for some reason. <laughs> what the heck? Five receivers set for the Tigers on first and ten. And nice completion. That'll end the first quarter. Well, the Patriots on top 14 to nothing over the Clemson Tigers here in ACC play. Oh, nice deflection, Mullins. Let's go, buddy. coverage and the fullback is gonna get bodied in the backfield Norm Blunt on the stop and Clemson's promising drive comes to an end at the 48 yard line of the Marine Corps from it guys oh my goodness favorable bounce for the Patriots up to the 15 oh nice tackle first career sack for Richards That's unfortunate. They had McCall open too. It's going for the deep pass over the middle. And again, a weird animation. And McKelvey just runs full speed and then stops. And that makes it third down and 20 from the five yard line. That's unfortunate. McKelvey hit as he threw it. And Clemson right inside the 10 yard line because of that play. And man, 
Landry gets the pick in the end zone. Oh my goodness, let's go. Beautiful. Two receivers, one defender, and the DB comes away with the ball. Oh, hey, Marvin, you're still there. <laughs> What's up, buddy? Here we go. Run, McKelvey. All the way to the 40-yard line. My goodness. Thought for sure that was going to be caught. And Smith up to the 47 yard line. I think that's his first carry of the game. To go halfback blast on third and three. Switch it to the right. And a really good play by the linebacker. Gets off the block from Sap and makes the stop. Nice tackle inside the 20 yard line by Albert Washington. Right, is that his name? I can't remember. That's what we're going with. Nice tackle. Four tackles in the game for Hartley. Second down and 10 for the Tigers. Two receivers in the area. Really awkward design play. And third down and three coming up from the 25. Get him, boys. Oh my goodness, he just dropped it. He was open too. That was a really good throw. Wow. Eighteen point seven yards per punt return on the season for Darius Curtis. Who's been really good on punt returns for us in his career. Oh, we almost blocked that. My goodness. I don't see how close we were to blocking that. I think that's the closest we've ever been to blocking a punt in this game. A couple yards short. off to the fullback on second and inches. And he'll move the 
chains. Easy money. Oh, no way. Oh, what? Wow. Tight end never even tried to catch it. He didn't even put his hands out for it. Unreal. I swear, we just try to find ways to give the team the ball back. Stevens! Oh my goodness! What a pick from Stevens. No way. And we don't get a replay for that? He deflects it to himself. Bounces off his hands, off his helmet, off his shoulder pad, and then picks it. And then spins out the receiver. My goodness gracious. That was crazy. Hundred and forty four yards, two touchdowns on the season for Christensen. Stevenson moves the chains to midfield. Smith gets maybe five yards on the run. Third down and five. Right. So many turnovers, I could open up a bakery. <laughs> You're probably right. Surprised that wasn't picked. All right, we'll punt it away again. down there Washington all right good play inside the 10 yard line down at the nine and incomplete I think the receiver just dropped that one your pro fight night rankings work however you want them to work buddy incomplete pass Washington on the coverage they're down in 10 coming up Defense! 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 
quarterback play is uh, pretty awful right now. It's as if Jameis Winston is quarterbacking both teams. That's definitely what it feels like. I can't even argue with that. Let's go, Curtis. Crazy thing is, I'm still using the same exact difficulty, same sliders as we've been using since the end of season one. But the past handful of games, it just feels like the quarterbacks have been really bad for the computer team, at least. Oh my goodness. I don't know how I got positive yards out of that. Freshman difficulty? No, nope, we're still on Heisman. That's what it's been the whole time. Massive overthrow right there. He's wide open. Dang it. Bench the quarterback. You know what? I might put in the freshman for the second half. Just because. Pretty sure he's got better throwing abilities. Oh, what a hit by uh, Mullins. My goodness. All right, we're up 14 nothing at halftime. Very sloppy game. Minus 10 overall. Goodness gracious. Run, Curtis! Up to the 28-yard line. I'm not doing a halfback draw, coach. I'm just not doing it. There you go, freshman. Run, buddy. Oh my goodness, juked out the safety. All right, we well, see he can run it, but can he throw it? McCall, oh my goodness. Wow. The walk-on wide receiver out here mossing people.
Sutherland not quite as quick as McKelvey. Second down and two. Hakeem Smith, oh my goodness, destroyed. But gets the first down. Oh, he's tired. He's tired, boys. Second down four coming up. Oh, fresh leg Stevenson inside the five down to the three. Donnell Sapp, the fullback. And he's down to the one yard line. Sutherland gets his first career touchdown run. We're extending lead to 20 to zero in the third quarter. Now 21 nothing with the extra point from Mills after a nine place 71 yard drive to 242 off the clock. Trying to get our first ever conference victory. Quarterback draw. That went nowhere. Kwame Gatewood shut that thing down. Severe overthrow. 81 was open for a second. Both teams terrible on third down. Clemson 1 of 7. Ring Corps 1 of 6. Oh my goodness. What is this play selection? I don't get it. It's like I'm going up against a bunch of teams that have Pop Warner coaches as their head coach. Run, Stevenson. He's only given the running back five carries in the game. Doesn't make any sense. <coughs> Big 
Big dog, big dog. Simon, oh, he might be gone. Run, Simon. All the way inside the 10-yard line. Great throw from Sutherland as well. Yeah, Sutherland definitely has a better arm than McKelvey. Kelby's just really dangerous on the run. Which is what we have needed <laughs> since we had to run away from defenders who break through the line of scrimmage so quickly. Second and goal from the five. Oh my goodness, defensive tackle blew up the right guard. And Daryl Newton, our center, has injured his arm on the play. So our true freshman that we got in the offseason will get his first little bit of playing time. Let's see how he can do. Number 61. All right, third and goal. Sutherland stopped short around the two-yard line. Man, we'll just kick a field goal. Try the field goal at least. 19-yard attempt for Mills. And it is good. 24-0. In the third quarter. for two quarters with a strained tricep. Oh, nice deflection. I probably would have had that pick too. Deflection. These plays are just not working. Oh, my goodness, what is this quarterback doing? He's putting me to sleep with this offense, I tell you that much. One-on-one coverage. And can't come down with it. That was McKnight out there.
Just 107 on third down in the game. Hey, we got that one. Two for eight. Let's go. his hands and he gets rocked oh my goodness look at the time of possession they've gone three and out so much this game oh boy well that didn't work that play was messed up from the start. Third and 17. Get it, Walker. Oh, he drops it. Dang it. Well, that's the end of the third quarter. Get your fours up in the chat, folks. We're up 24 to nothing over the Clemson Tigers here in our first ever ACC matchup. And another punt inside the 20-yard line. The quarterback is a bad player. He's almost a full bar of red. I wonder why he can't complete a pass. I wonder if he's a freshman. Richard sophomore. Oof. He can run the ball. Normally 86 accuracy. Yeah, where? This guy looks pretty decent though. 93 and 82. Only a 72 overall for that guy though. And I have quarterback accuracy up for the computer AI as well. It's almost all the way up. It's like three three quarters of the way. He threw that into at least quadruple covered. He's 4 of 22. What are they doing? Man, he is bad. Sutherland is the wrong quarterback to run the option. More of a fit for an air raid or pro style offense. I agree. I do. I customized this playbook to match McKelvey's play style. So, might have to make some adjustments if Sutherland is in fact going to be the starter next season. Might put in some more uh, single back sets or maybe some more shotgun sets instead of uh, all the I-formation plays. Well, he can definitely throw it. Oh my goodness.
All right, coach, what do you want? I'm not doing a halfback screen. Sorry. Oh my goodness, the ref got right in his way. Overthrown. Dang it. Still needs a little work on the accuracy. But he's got a cannon for an arm. McCall, wide open. Best wide receiver walk on of all time. Call again. Down to the six. <laughs> He's leading the team four catches, 75 yards in the game. Oh, what a throw and catch. Oh, my goodness. No way did I think he was going to complete that. Wow. <laughs> oh, man. That was beautiful. <laughs> 31 to 0 in the fourth quarter. Shut out? I don't know. So plenty of time left for them. Great kickoff. Of course, we destroyed Clemson the last time we played him too, so this isn't really a big surprise. But the fact that their quarterback has like four completions in the game is insane. Wow, his receivers aren't helping him out either. Four of 23? I know our team's pretty good, but we shouldn't be destroying teams like conference opponents like this. Not in our first season in the conference, at least. Some awful play calling. Fifty nine yards of offense. What? Run, Curtis. Good return up to midfield.
Well, hopefully we can have a more competitive game against North Carolina next game. Just think, we lost to Akron on this difficulty in sliders that we're using. That was our last loss. How long are we planning on staying in the ACC? I don't know, probably forever. Get that ball. I oh, caught that. It's just out of bounds. McKnight. First and goal. Coming up. Sutherland over 200 yards of offense in the second half alone. Schedule Akron for next year, revenge game. Well, I promised Tyler that I would try to schedule a Michigan game next season. We couldn't do it this year. Touchdown, Patriots. Oh, my goodness. Woof. Sutherland putting on a show in the second half. But if I'm not able to get Michigan on the schedule in the offseason, I'll probably end up putting Akron in there. Just so we can stomp them. Akron is better than Michigan. They might be. I don't know. I haven't seen Michigan do anything yet in this series. Nice deflection by Norwood. We almost have had the ball for 20 minutes on offense. That is insane. Quarterback draw goes nowhere. They have their backups in now. I'm not putting my backups in though. Continue the domination. Continue it. Thoughts on cream soda? Uh, I got a 12 pack in my fridge, buddy. Wow, he dropped that. Oh my goodness. Their receivers are trash. I like cream soda in glass better than in a can, though. I got ice cold. Glass bottle. So good. I'm just going to keep putting in work with Sutherland. Why not? He got player of the game. He's only played the second half.
Got two corners on the right side. Nice spin move by Christensen. Didn't go anywhere though. Simon drops it. That would have been close to a touchdown, too. Hey, we've only been sacked twice this game. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> oh, wow. How is that even kick catch interference? I don't even, he didn't even call a fair catch. Did he? Either way, that was awesome. <laughs> yeah. My goodness, these receivers are getting destroyed out here. I mean, these quarterbacks are just leaving them out there just to just die in the middle of the field. Oh, they finally made a play. And it's a touchdown for Clemson. <laughs> I just bounced right off of him with Washington. About time somebody did something on this team. I'm not even mad I lost the shutout. Not even mad. That's alright, we had a couple shutouts in a row. Shut out Stanford in the bowl game. We shut out Air Force. At least this way it looks like Clemson had a little bit of life in this game. <laughs> they just doubled their yards for the entire game. More than doubled their yards for the whole game. Craziness. Wow, kicks that right out of bounds. And that is going to be the final, 38-7, to as we crush Clemson in our... ACC opener. That was not even close. We're going to be hosting North Carolina. I believe it was North Carolina in our next game. Man, who was their coach at this point? I can't even remember. Did Tommy Tuberville? Where, where did Tommy Tuberville coach? I don't remember. Well, we absolutely crushed these guys. 6 of 28 passing they were. Wow, we weren't much better. 10 of 26. Almost had the ball for 20 minutes in this game. Hmm. 
McKelvey, 3 of 11. Two picks. Woof. Lee McCall, four catches, 75 yards. Alex McKnight, three for 40 with a touchdown. Kareem Scott had a touchdown as well. Norwood and Hartley both had four tackles. Six tackles for a loss for the defense. No sacks, two picks. Bunch of deflections. Hartley with a forced fumble. Mills, one for one field goals. Lots of punts in the game. Easy dub. Tuberville was coaching him then. I know. Then he came back and wasn't he? Didn't he coach? Uh, was it Texas Tech for a while? I can't remember where he went after that. All right, we'll save this. Simulate the rest of week three. And then get into our fourth game of the day. Oh, he was coaching Auburn at the time. Three. West Virginia beats Maryland. USC beats Temple. Virginia beats Vandy. Ohio destroyed Alabama. We're 17th in the country now. Riding a 15 game winning streak. We no longer have the number one pass defense. That's crazy somebody has a better pass defense. Oh, I guess the teams that haven't played yet. How are we in week four and North Carolina hasn't played a single game yet? What? That's crazy. Well, the game is televised. Speaking of Michigan, there they are. Just beat Oregon. Hey, look at that. We're on the conference standings cover. Patriots win their ACC opener. 38-7 against Clemson. The way to play. Yeah, see, we don't have any greatest games. I know I've mentioned this before. But it's just not registering any of them. So that must be like a bug in this game or something. Alright, let's go take on North Carolina. Michigan beats Notre Dame, 41-35. USC crushes Nebraska, 51 to something. Lake Forest beats Clemson. Rutgers put up 62 on Texas Tech, who also put up 59. Rice beats Texas. Oh my goodness. Miami beats Maryland. Maryland now 0 and 2. And was that Virginia Tech beat Florida State? I believe.
All right. Let's take on the Tar Heels. We got a night game. I think it's raining. I showed Norm Blunt for like two seconds right there. <laughs> Got some fans up in the upper deck. Let's go. We should have like seven bars of Stadium Pulse, I think. Maybe, yeah, probably seven. Folks, that's the most we've ever had. Let's go. Yeah, good luck hearing that. Draw. And Norm Blunt gets the tackle. Carolina trying to establish the ground game early on. Oh, Landry. Come on, baby. Second down and ten. Scream. Oh, Johnson with the deflection. What's our record? We are three and zero on the season. We're down and ten coming up. It would be Air Force, Notre Dame, and Clemson to start the year. Oh, good play. Oh, and he drops it. Well, a promising start to that drive, and it just, just dies. The ball, Washington. Oh, my goodness. God, I can't stay when that happens. Right, first and goal for the Tar Heels now.
Wow, touchdown North Carolina. Not sure what Washington was doing there. All that set up by a fumbled punt return by Darius Curtis. Ridiculous. It's always something just something dumb like that. Always. Are you kidding me? Wow. That's two straight kick returns that Landry has just dropped. Crazy. Good tackle. Little fullback blast. And Sab carries a couple guys up to the 35 yard line for a first down. cost it up again. What are we doing? Do we just not want to win this game? Is that what it is? Goodness gracious. deflection. Third and nine coming up. Wide open on the left side of the field. Oh my goodness. Easy run for DeMarco McKelvey. One on one. And that is definitely pass interference. You can't just straight up tackle somebody like that, my guy. Second down and seven from the 26. Oh, what a throw to, oh my goodness, to Simon inside the 10 yard line. Beautiful throw. And that is a touchdown for the Patriots. Let's go. Extra point away from tying it up. That was a great slant route. Yeah. 
Extra point is good. Seven all here in Lima, Virginia. All right, let's get a stop on defense now. Oh, McClendon. And McClendon makes the stop. All right. Now they don't have the ball in really good field position, so let's see if they can sustain a drive. I don't think they can. Nice run. This running back's really good, though. Cannot believe that Rice beat Texas. That is just crazy to me. Get him, boys. Good stop. Let's go. Norwood on the tackle for a loss. Second down and 12 coming up. Quarterback draw. Went nowhere. LJ Carroll on the tackle. He is fired up. Third down and 10 now. From the 37 yard line. Oh, no way. I don't know how I didn't deflect that. What a throw by Kennedy. He is 3 of 6, 52 yards and a touchdown so far in the game. Dang, that was close to being a fumble. It looked like it was almost a backwards pass. running people over. Oh my goodness. Blunt on the tackle. They're down on three coming up. Let's go Thunder Green. Blitz the outside linebackers. And that is incomplete. Jason Landry on the deflection. They're going to try a field goal. That's a 46 yard attempt. For the Tar Heels. And that is no good. He pushed it to the right. Let's go. Good stop for the defense. Marco. Easy yards. Right. 
what was that? I don't know how I got yards out of that, but I couldn't move with McKelvey. He was just frozen as soon as he snapped it. What the heck was that? That was crazy. down 16 coming up nice deflection had Simon open too oh it was terrible Goodness gracious. Both teams pretty evenly matched so far in the game. There's no way that that ball got to him when there's two defenders in between the quarterback and the halfback. 10 out of 10 times, if I did that, we fumble it, they recover it. Crazy. Stevens jars the ball loose. Incomplete pass. Play by the D-line, getting some pressure on the quarterback, bring up third down and 10. And incomplete. They're going to go for it on fourth and 10, though. From our 38 yard line. Makes sense to go for it. They're not in field goal range. You don't really want to punt it from here. And Stevens picks it off inside the 10 yard line. His third interception of the season, I believe. Great takeaway. Nice to juke to the outside there. Still a good run. That's the end of the first quarter. All tied up. Seven apiece here in Quantico, Virginia. In ACC action. Play by the defense, closing in on that option attack. And it's third down and four now. Oh, we almost caught it again anyway. <laughs> oh my goodness. Well, guess we'll punt it away again. See if I can punt it more than 15 yards this time. Yeah. 
Much better. Uh-oh. Good return by Thorpe, their halfback. No tar and feather those heels. I don't know about that. These guys are playing pretty good. It's about time we've had a, a good game. Close game. Oh, nice pass to Todd for the touchdown. One-on-one -on -one with five-star free safety, Brandon Johnson. Extra point up and good. It's 14 to seven. Tar Heels on top of the Patriots here in Quantico, Virginia. Wow, Landry actually caught the return. Didn't get anywhere, but at least he caught the ball. All right, coach, what do you want to run? Play action screen. No. What is the matter with you? Let's try to get these running backs going a little bit. They did pretty good the first couple games. Should've just took off. Receiver stopped on his route. Terrible. Third down and six coming up. Both teams just one third down conversion apiece in the game. Oh, nice juke. Kelby moving the chains. Try to hit him with play action now out of that same formation. Might hit L on the wheel route. If we have time. Oh my goodness, he caught it off the deflection and then dropped it. Come on, man. Somebody make a play for the quarterback, please. I'm begging you. Oh my goodness gracious. Sure, slot seams. Sounds great, coach. Let's run it. Oh, nice juke, McKelvey. Didn't get the first down, though. by win. I still don't know what position that guy plays. Might be one of the tight ends. I'm not sure. I'm too lazy to check.
get that pick. Oh my goodness. He would have been gone if he caught it. The 99 speed. Let's go boys. Third and three. They can't hear anything. I love it. Counter. And he got it. Dang it. I'm blitzing. And good tackle by Norm Blunt, the defensive end. And they keep running the ball on us, I guess. Doing a pretty good job. Nine carries, 51 yards for Thorpe. Another third down. About three and a half yards to go. Play in around. Get him. Stevens. Oh my goodness. He still gets the first down. I hate that play. One of my least favorite plays in all football games ever. Here we go. Good tackle. The Samson. Yes, it was. Number 90. He took over Billy Lawrence's spot at D tackle next to Kwame Gatewood. And Stevens gets another pick. His second of the game. Let's go. Beautiful. Come on, Walker. Aw, oh, dang it. Gotta get something going here. Switch it up to the left. And get absolutely destroyed up front. Oh boy. Oh boy, oh boy. Offense is frustrating right now. Get out of the way, lineman. Let's go, Simon. Good catch, buddy. If I can get some blocking on the left here, this could be decent to toss to the left. Didn't block the safety. Still got a few yards, though. Carl, oh no, he was wide open. Come on, baby, you gotta catch that. They're down seven now after the drop.
Easy first down. McKelvey, no surprise, is carrying the team on the ground. Once our O-line can get up into like the mid 80s and 90s for overalls, we'll be able to do traditional style offense where we just hand the ball off and be able to run successfully against good teams. We had success against Air Force because they're just not really a good team. But ever since then, we have not. Oh, Walker. Oh, come on. You didn't even have to dive for that, man. There was no need to dive. We're going for it. Could be first down. Let's go, McKelvey. Two seconds left. Plenty of time. Up to McCall. And he comes down with it inside the five yard line. Let's go. Beautiful play. Cannot get in the end zone. Under 20 seconds to go in the first half. And this time Sapp does punch it in. We're an extra point away from tying this thing up at 14. No, I did not recruit McCall. He was a walk-on wide receiver. Extra point is good. 14 apiece. After 13 play, 85 yard drive. Took 216 off the clock. seconds left in the half. Got ourselves a pretty good game. Good tackle by Stevens. And that will take us into the locker rooms for halftime. All tied up at 14 here in ACC play. You get the ball to start the third quarter. Curtis up to the 22. And the offense will take the field again. Not a good throw. <laughs> Hopefully I don't start sneezing a bunch. 
And McKelvey picks up maybe six yards, maybe. Yep, six yards. Let's go. They're down to four coming up. Let's go quick slants here on the right. Take your time, McKelvey. Take your time. Get that McKnight. Oh, off his hands. Come on, man. You've got to catch that, buddy. That was a terrible kick all the way around. Trash. And a nice deflection by Stevens. Kennedy, 4 of 17 now. Wow. I don't know what else I got to do to make the quarterbacks more accurate. Like, I have their accuracy up on the sliders. I, I don't get it. I have wide receiver catching up. Direct snap. Miles Dawkins. That went nowhere. Norwood on the stop. Stevens almost gets another one. Five hurries for the defense, two picks, no sacks so far in this game. But a nice stop. And Darius Curtis will be back deep to return this punt. Oh my. Try a weak counter. See if this will work or not. Get the tight end in motion. Extra blocker over there. And my right guard did not pull the way he was supposed to. And let the defense attack or run free and destroy the halfback. That's unfortunate. That could have been good because there wasn't anybody on the outside. And Smith is really shifty, so he, he could have got quite a few yards there. Got a man wide open. It's Simon inside the 35-yard line. Great throw from DeMarco McKelvey. Beautiful play. Top to McKnight, and he drops another one. Oh, my goodness. It's just, it's just not good. Not good at all. Call drops one two. So three straight drops. Uh, 
we're not taking a field goal from there, that's for sure. Fourth down and ten, not in field goal range, but we're not punting it either. Oh, McKelvey. Oh, that's easy. And inside the 10 yard line, first and goal, Marine Corps. Way too easy. They left him way too much space. Or Stevenson, rather, cannot get any blocking up front. It's so not quite there yet for traditional run plays against quality opponents. Wide open, touchdown, Patriots. We got the lead. Let's go. Walker wide open. Nine plays, sixty eight yard drive, one fifty off the clock, and it's twenty one fourteen. Defense, let's get it. Oh, boy. Yeah, he is fast. Oh, my goodness. I had no shot on that one. He's got to have like 94, 95 speed. What a throw. And just like that, they're going to tie it up. Dang. I want to see what his speed is. Yeah, 96. And Stevens is only 90 or 91. Oh, 92 speed for John Stevens. Yeah, that four speed is a big difference. I had no shot there. Channeled his inner Lightning McQueen on that one? He sure did. Curtis, pretty good return there. Every time I hand it off, we're just like running into a brick wall. At least we got four yards, but still. What the heck? Halfback blast, maybe? Maybe that'll work? And or Stevenson gets close to the first down marker, and they do give it to him. I'm going to try wide receiver post. See if the tight end has enough speed to get out there on the wheel route. Oh my goodness, McKelvey. Oh my goodness. Inside the 40.
got ourselves a ball game, folks. Nice deflection. These guys are all over it, man. What was your favorite Disney movie? Oh man, there's so many. Um, that's a good question. I don't know, I'd probably have to say Brave. Disney, right? Pretty sure it's Disney. Run, McKelvey! I know you're tired, buddy. Oh my goodness. Did you get Madden 05 and draft some players? Welcome to the chat, the Slick 93. I do have Madden 05, and usually we do have a college series matched up with an NFL series together with imported draft classes, but this one is just like my return to streaming. So it's just a standalone series, but we will be going back to our North Carolina Tar Heels dynasty in NCAA 04, finishing that one up, and then we'll do a series in this game with an actual college, and then we'll have a Madden 05 franchise alongside of that with the imported draft classes. But well, that's usually what we do. I usually do the uh, imported classes. I have every single NCAA and Madden game for the PS2. Oh, nice deflection. Dang it. Disney under the Pixar brand. Yeah, I knew it was. I knew Pixar had something to do with it too. I feel like they got their hands in everything. All right, third and goal. Oh, and the call was open. I just got sacked instantly. Dang it. Oh, that's so unfortunate. Well, let's hope for a field goal, I guess. I think I made it. Maybe. And we got it. All right. We're up 24-21. After that 10 play, 63-yard drive to 223 off the clock. It's so nice when I actually make field goals. It's a beautiful thing. Nice tackle. in the USA released and Espanol version of Madden 08. Oh my goodness, Marvin. <laughs> oh, man. Sorry, right, you'll complete the collection one day. Let's go, Stevens. Wow, that guy almost caught that, too. Both quarterbacks, uh, trash in this game. Trash and more trash. I just don't know what to do to make the completion percentage better in this game. It's impossible. Did we just stop him? Dominique Mullins! He got the stop! Let's go, baby! Fourth down. They're going to punt away.
Oh my goodness. Ron Curtis! Oh, I tried to spin to the right. Couldn't do it. Man, I am just so determined to get us a punt return or a kick return touchdown. It's got to happen eventually, right? It's been four seasons. Oh my goodness. the end of the third quarter folks get your fours up in the chat we're up 24 21 over north carolina nicole got him to the 31 yard line let's go baby Got the collector's edition of 05 and the Hall of Fame edition of 07. Nice. Pretty sure I have the Hall of Fame edition of 07 as well. One on one. Can't get there. Dang it. McKelvey doesn't pitch it, and of course we cough it up. Why not? Why not? It seems like the right thing to do. Just give him the football, you know? We're only trying to close out the game. Oh my goodness, why didn't he just pitch it? That is so frustrating. Like you, your arm did the motion. Just let go of the football, guy. Oh my goodness, that would have been probably the most insane interception of all time if Johnson caught that. Yeah, y'all can't hear nothing. Quarterback for all. How'd that work out for you? Just ran into Kwame Gatewood, who's six foot seven and three hundred plus pounds. Oh no way! Oh come on! Just carries him for the first down. That's tough. He's too fast. Oh, let's go. Let's go, baby. <laughs> LJ Carroll, the defensive end, is all the way down the field. No way. There's no way this man really did this. No way. Wow. LJ Carroll, the defensive end, runs all the way down the field to recover that fumble. That is crazy. Can use the same file between them. Really? They were different like that? That's crazy. I didn't know that. I cannot believe Carol recovered that fumble. The hustle, man. Second down and seven. Night. Nice. 
We're getting the matchups that we want. One on one coverage out there. Just can't make the play. 22 of 67. That's just dumb. Punt the ball right back to him, I guess. After a lovely four-yard drive. Run some of the clock out while we're at it. Get down there, boys. Dude almost blocked me right into him. They have 206 yards passing, and I am not okay with that. Stevens with another deflection. Let's go. And Stevens with the tackle on Thorpe. Thorpe had a really good first half, and then North Carolina just kind of moved away from running the football with him for some reason. Get that. Oh my goodness. I should have had a pick six right there. Couldn't get it off the deflection though. They're gonna punt it from the 42. Let's go safer turn. No, let's go middle fan. We'll do that. Buckley's edition had extra stuff on this. More classic teams while well, there's three other versions of Madden. That is true. That is very true, Marvin. And a good punt. Out of bounds inside the 15 yard line. get enough of a push up front. Get something going. I'm trying, Tyler. I'm trying, buddy. I really am. We're still young on, on the old line, so it's tough right now. Oh my goodness, this guy just walks right in. Yeah, those three offensive linemen that we got in the offseason, they're going to be really good in a couple seasons. Like, when they're juniors, they're going to be, like, mid-80s at least. They're down at 10 for the Patriots. No! Simon, oh, what a catch. Let's go. Oh, baby. Wow. I did not think he was coming down with that one. What a play. And we're just going to take off with McKelvey. Oh, my goodness. Oof. Disgusting. Get there. Oh, I couldn't get there with Walker.
Yeah, I remember they put the stuff on a second disc for 07. I do remember that. Trying to scream. We had four blockers against two defenders. And we blocked one guy. You've got to love it. You got to. Oh boy. Uh oh. He's fast. He's fast. I did not get it. He's fast, fast. Well, I guess we're punting it away yet again. Pretty well for us. Down at the 12 yard line. Come on, boys, let's finish this game strong. Less than two minutes away from starting season four and up. Where's he going with this? Oh, boy. Nice throw and catch. Just got away from Johnson. I was trying to cover two different guys deep. I'm trying, Tyler. I'm trying, buddy. I promise. Well, he threw it in quadruple coverage. We couldn't come away with it. Kennedy, player of the game for North Carolina. McKelvey, player of the game for the Marine Corps. No surprise there. He's been doing everything on offense today. Oh, come on! Stevens should have had the hat trick right there. That might have sealed it, too, if we picked it. All right, third down and 10 for the Tar Heels. Screen. Oh, no. Oh, what a move. Wow. We've allowed 327 yards of offense. That is unacceptable. Fourth down and three for the game. For the game, baby. Direct snap to the fullback. Oh, he got it. No way. I just got Miles Dawkins with a fullback. Unbelievable. Oh, Stevens gets the hat trick, baby. Let's go. That's going to seal the deal. Oh, my goodness. Let's go. Go! Get out of here! And that is the difference, the turnovers. We got four takeaways, and they took the ball away from us twice. That'll be the final timeout for the Tar Heels. The sap gets six yards up the gut. Sapp with 20 yards in the game on seven carries with a touchdown. Again, I'm not sure why North Carolina moved away from their ground game. Uh, it was working pretty well in the first half. Take the knee. Why would I want to do that? I want 400 yards of offense. I'm greedy. I'm a greedy man, Eric. That's all right. He'll be fine. 
Patriots playing Tar Heels kneecap. <laughs> I like it. All right, we get the dub, 24 to 21 over the North Carolina Tar Heels. We are 4 and 0 to start the season. And that was a good game. I cannot believe that's their first game of the season. That's kind of crazy. I don't know what our next game is. Can't remember. Twenty-four, twenty-one. That one receiver is nasty with that ninety-six speed. Goodness gracious. Stevens with three picks in the game. They were 9 of 30 throwing. We were 9 of 27, but we had 225 yards on the ground. They only had 81. We got sacked four times. We uh, had four takeaways. They only had two. We had the ball for 17 and a half minutes. And there was no points put up in the entire fourth quarter. McKelvey, 180 yards, two touchdowns. Completion percentage is just garbage. 173 yards on the ground from McKelvey. Running backs, uh, not really good for average yards per carry. Well, Sap had the touchdown, had a fumble as well. Steven Simon. Four catches, 99 yards. Lee McCall, two for 66. Touchdowns from Michael Walker and Alex McKnight. What are the drops like? Five drops for us. And they only had four, apparently. Okay. Defense, John Stevens, five tackles, three picks. Hartley had five tackles as well at outside linebacker. No sacks in the game. Bunch of deflections for Stevens as well. Four of them. Two for Washington. Two for Johnson. Two for Landry. One for Hartley. One for Carroll. Forced fumble for Albert Washington, the number one recruit in the country. And it was recovered by LJ Carroll, who hustled down the field to dive on that thing. Chris Mills, one of one field goals. And that is it for that game. Simulate the rest of the week. Sap uh, is not seriously injured either, so don't worry about it. All right, we're 4-0. 2-0 in ACC play. Yeah, just save it all, would you? My goodness. Yeah, so Virginia Tech beats Florida State by one point, 36-35. What a game that was. And we have both of those teams on our schedule. We also have Wake Forest, who is ranked as well. So we had a pretty decent schedule, actually. We had Notre Dame, Florida State, Wake Forest, Virginia Tech, four, at least four ranked schools uh, that were on our preseason schedule. Simulate the rest of this week, see who we got for the next game. And I'm going to get out of here, I think. Well, we'll be streaming tomorrow as well. I'll post in the Discord. If you're not in the Discord yet, go ahead and join us. There's a link on the channel and in the description of all the other streams for this series so far. Not in this one yet. But I'll also... I if I remember, I will post in the YouTube community as well when the stream will be tomorrow. It's supposed to rain, so I won't be having football or yeah, football practice, basketball practice. Well, starting in June, my Sundays will be taken up by basketball games because that's when our season starts.
All right, simulate the rest of week four as Penn State crushes USF. And we're taking on Wake Forest for the next stream to start that one off. And I, th I think after them is Duke. I think. I can't remember. I'm old. My brain is a potato. Alright, we are all the way up to 13th in the country, guys. That is our highest ranking in school history. Wake Forest is at number 10. Wow. That is a nationally broadcast um, program, game, if you will. They have the 10th best offense in the country, 9th best defense. We still have the number one defense in the land. It's been like that for a few seasons now. Uh, but our offense is, is a little shaky, especially in the passing attack. Uh, but we're on a 16-game winning streak. We haven't lost since week one last season. To the Akron Zips, I think it was 22-20 to 20 we lost that one. But my goodness, this game is going to be a doozy, folks. Let's check out the Sports Illustrated real quick. Miami's win over Maryland. Headlines, some great top 25 matchups, yada, yada, yada. Rice beats Texas, we saw that. Hurricanes quarterback on the Heisman watch list. Players of the week, conference standings. And we're not on there. All right, but that is it for this stream, guys. I'll let you guys take a gander at this matchup as I close out this stream. I'll see you tomorrow. I'm not sure what time yet, but like I said, I'll let you know in the Discord if you are in there. I will keep you guys up to date on that. But that's it for this stream, guys. Until tomorrow, take it easy, guys.